That question is by Jonathan. Jonathan, another great question. Now, take a look here at this listing here, all right? We've got a listing of how many reviews? Let's see here. It's got 19 ratings, all right? So you look at 19 ratings, and it looks like they're all five-star, all right? Now, you see all of the listings are five stars. So does that tell you anything? No, not really. You can't really tell from this. Uh, I mean, it looks like most of them are variations. So we need to find a listing that has a mixture, all right? Take a look at this new skin one. This one only has two ratings. Now, take a look at this. One of the ratings is five star and one is three star. Now, if all things were equal, two ratings, one is five, one is three. What does your computer-like mind say that the rating should be? four, right? But is it four? No, it's 3.8. All right. Well, let's take a look here. Both of these are verified. All right. So both of these are verified. How can it be 3.8? Is that funny math by Jeff Bezos? No, take a look here. If I mouse over what is going on right here, it says here, Amazon calculates a product's star ratings based on a machine learning, um, get back here, uh, based on a machine learning model instead of a raw data average. The model takes into account factors including the age of a rating, whether the ratings are from verified purchasers, and factors that establish reviewer trustworthiness. Interesting. So that's why you see that even though these are both verified, it comes up with a funky little score here because there's these other factors involved. What about Does that mean that unverified reviews aren't taken into consideration at all? Let's take a look at this one. This one is four customer ratings, okay? And it's a 3.5 out of five stars. Now take a look. Do you notice anything about these ones right here? Let's take a look here at these listings. What do you notice? There is no verification on this, okay? Now on this last one here, on this last one, It is verified and it is five stars, all right? But what is the overall rating? It's only 3.5 stars, okay? We can see which one is bringing it down because this is a one-star listing right here. So are unverified reviews taken into consideration? Yes, they are. How much does it count? I personally don't know the algorithm that's going into this, but as you can see, if it was only taken into consideration these verified reviews, this product would be five stars, all right? And if it wasn't taken into consideration, the unverified reviews, again, it wouldn't have mattered that this is a one-star item, but it's obviously bringing it down. So Jonathan, in answer to your question, yes, uh, verified and unverified are kind of weighted differently, but unverified reviews do have some kind of count. But even if all things are equal, all reviews are not considered equal. They're all not created equal, all right? That means that, uh, you know, be based on Amazon's internal algorithm that goes into things that are as crazy as buyer trustworthiness, you have no idea uh, what is going on into this rating system. So keep that in mind the next time you're stressing about your rating on your listing. It might not just be, uh, you know, that verified listing uh, or it might not be just that unverified but it could be a relationship of different factors that are being involved. Thanks a lot, Jonathan.